One of the things I love about Adelaide has got to be the variety of pubs, from the traditional to the glamorous and everything in between. We are never short of a place to go for a drink. And today I'm going to show you a handful of places that are refreshingly different and unique, starting at the end. Just west of the city on Henley Beach Road, you'll find the Mile End Hotel, sister pub to the colonist in Norwood. The end, as it's known, has a new beginning. Yesterday's regular pub is now a delightful eclectic mishmash that's part hotel, part art gallery, with a hefty dose of cool Nana's lounge room thrown in. Following on from her brilliant work at The Colonist, the owners chose to once again enlist the talent of State Theatre Company senior artist Sandra Anderson. Her style is epitomised by pop art pieces scattered around the hotel and the cheeky hand-painted Norman Lindsay-inspired mural in the dining room. Ooh, feeling a little bit overdressed in here. Those familiar with The Colonist would no doubt have noticed its impressive ice chandelier. The statement piece at this hotel, however, is... Wait for it. The Chandelier. Slightly odd, but it's cool. Now, over to North Adelaide, where the Lion Hotel has been getting the full spit and polish treatment in preparation for the reopening of Adelaide Oval. The courtyard of old has been completely renovated, so I had to pop in for a look. Definitely a place to keep in the memory banks for those future balmy afternoons. And next, the Franklin Boutique Hotel, opposite the bus station in the city. From the outside, you only get a slight hint of how super cool this place is. I love the backyard, complete with hills hoist and graffiti artwork, which heralds the pub specialty, Frank's Gourmet Hot Dogs. More discoveries lie upstairs, where the accommodation has had a complete overhaul. As a dedicated lover of home reno shows and interior mags, I have to admit, this is the stuff my dreams are made of. I am so taken by this place. I love how they've used recycled wares. It is eclectic, it's modern and it's rustic all at the same time with amazing pops of colour. I think I found my happy place. <laughs> Unique pieces have been sourced from salvage yards and auction houses and then repurposed, rejigged and redesigned into something amazing. These rooms are a far cry from their former incarnation, as Kate Pettigrew explains. Upstairs was a backpackers, which had been like that for a numerous amount of years. Um, it had been run down and um, there was some pretty um, unusual furniture, unusual carpet for yeah. us to change. Now here's something you don't see very often, all of the complimentary add-ons. You get a little goodie bag, freebies from Frank, filled with delicious nibblies your own espresso, and get this, free mini bar, restocked daily, no less. Gotta love the little details. So for a city stay that's anything but beige, don't forget the Franklin, one of the last Adelaide pubs offering upstairs accommodation and a very cool place for a catch up. <laughs>